how to improve yourself. When we are all born as babies, we are born with infinite curiosity, always experimenting and always learning with great gusto. But after a few years, we lose that enthusiasm to learn and we are turned off to learn. So why does it happen like that? When children come to third class, fourth class, fifth class, and more often in higher classes, they get turned off. They don't want to learn. Many experts, they have discovered that mindsets, mindsets are at the heart of this problem of losing the enthusiasm to learn. What is that? What are those mindsets? Let us see. Some students, they have a fixed mindset. When they have this mindset, they do not want to try because it reveals their deficiencies and they don't want to look down. When such a thing happens, setbacks make them afraid to try anything and uh, deficiencies will derail them. Children with fixed mindsets think that intelligence is a fixed trait, a fixed quality. You only have a certain amount of intelligence and you can do nothing about that. That is why when a problem is given, when a task is given, when they think they can't do it, they simply don't try. They're afraid to try. But students with growth mindset, they think intelligence can be developed with learning, with effort, with mentorship and with dedication. This is what is the difference between the fixed mindset and the growth mindset. And uh, what to do about this growth mindset? How to get that one? What can we do about that? Children with fixed mindset, they think that ability, if you have the ability you need not put the effort. Without any effort, you will be able to do the things because it is already predetermined. And uh, if you have to put the effort, it is a sign that you do not have the ability. And this mindset that only if you have the ability, you can do it effortlessly. That is a very bad mindset. But children with growth mindset, they think effort is very, very important to activate the ability. It allows them to be their fullest and uh, with effort, they can improve their ability over the years. Children with students with fixed mindset they always try to be smart at any cost I have to look smart I should not look dumb so that is why what uh, they do is always their whole life they will be avoiding tasks that reveal their deficiency but students with growth mindset 
they capitalize on that deficiency and uh, they improve on that deficiency with good effort. Same happens with school students, with professional graduates or even the executives of the Fortune 500 companies. They know we can, everybody have some deficiencies and setbacks, failures. They are bound to have failures and they have to build on that, improve on that. Students with fixed mindsets think that deficiencies reveal their limitations and setbacks. So that's why they're always running from their mistakes, hiding their mistakes and concealing their deficiencies. But students with growth mindset, they think setbacks are important for learning. Focus on learning increases their ability. So they detect their mistakes, they process their mistakes and they correct their mistakes. So my dear friends, we should all develop a growth mindset, not a fixed mindset. Mind, brain is like a muscle. You can develop it, you can strengthen it with good effort and good practice and definitely and gradually over a period of time we can improve our ability, efficiency and skills. Good day to you all and see you all in my next video. Take care and stay safe.